Hey, I'm Chris, and I'm going to show you how to generate a signal using your data acquisition device in LabVIEW. If we switch over to LabVIEW, you'll see I've already placed my DAC assistant, and I'm acquiring a signal from a function generator. So in this demonstration, we're actually going to disconnect our signal from the function generator and wire it up to analog output zero on the same device. So we're going to generate our signal from analog output zero and acquire it on analog input zero. So to create the generation, I can place, create a new VI and also use a DAC assistant. So I'll right click my block diagram, go to output DAC assistant. And now I can walk through the wizard to, to create my task. So I'm going to generate a signal, do an analog output, and I want to generate a voltage. Now I can select analog output zero. And here I can configure my settings. I can set my signal output range, from, which is from negative 10 to 10, and my generation mode, which in this case, I'm going to be outputting a DC voltage, so I'll choose one sample on demand. Next, I'm going to place a while loop around my DAC assistant so I can continually run my VI and adjust the, volt, the output voltage. I can make my stop button a little bit bigger. And then on the front panel, I'm also going to add a slider control, which will control the voltage. And since my output range is from negative 10 to 10, I'll set that on the slider. And next, wire the slider to the data input on my DAC assistant. Now when I run the VI, you can see when I adjust the slider or input VI, the graph on the input VI also adjusts as well. In addition to outputting just a DC voltage, we can also output a waveform. And to do that, we can use the simulate signals VI. So I'll delete the slider control. I can right click go to input and select simulate signal and in this express vi we can configure what we want our signal to look like so we can choose our signal type between sine square triangle we can also adjust the frequency and even the amplitude and i can wire the output of the simulate signal to the input of my dac assistant in addition, I need to reconfigure my DAC assistant. Since now I'm outputting a waveform, I need to change my generation mode to continuous samples. And I'll also leave it checked to take the timing from the waveform. I'll press OK. And now when I run the VI, we'll be able to see our triangle waveform on our input VI. And that's how you generate a signal using LabVIEW and an NI data acquisition device.